Hello, we have here a man. A man who has been affected by Scientology. Tell us about it. I used to have a good life. What happened? I used to have a good Christian woman. And it all started when she got a job at the chiropractor's office. Why the chiropractor's office? What's... I told her not to. Why? Because they believe in spells and stretchings and stretching yourself in the shape of a pentagram and that kind of stuff. Why didn't you do it? Why did I let her do it? Where is she now? Do you know? I laugh because right now she's at a Scientology meeting. What is she even doing there? What do they do? She's learning. What do they learn? They learn... You know... It's like any other thing. It starts with the smaller things. Like your kid wants to play Pokemon cards. And next thing you know, he kills people and uh, pretends to be Pikachu. So you're telling me that Pokemon <laughs> is part of the... Well, let's hold... It's an example that I've used. Oh. It started with chiropractoring, chiro chiropractology, and the stretches and the contorting yourself into satanic shapes and whatnot for help. And then she got a letter in the mail asking her to sign her life to Scientology. And naturally, I thought it's not. At first, I just didn't want to believe it. Um, <clears throat> and that's the thing. You never think that a person who you... Who was once perfectly normal and didn't worship Satan and didn't believe that UFOs were God would come to the point of believing that UFOs are God's messengers, that aliens created us, that God had sex with a volcano and created us in that way. Do you think she'll ever come back? I pray for it every day and I hope that it's a righteous prayer who do you pray to? God. Jesus. Not like her. She prays to aliens. She prays to Tom Cruise. She prays... She prays upon the weak. And she prays against the weak. Do you have a message for her that you want her to hear? Stop. Now. Come to Jesus. Aliens don't exist, and if they do, they are of Satan. Uh, Satan has nothing for you. He will trick you because you want to look healthy and do chiropractology. When you can be healthy while worshiping Jesus. You don't need Tom Cruise to tell you that Satan is Jesus. So what is your plan? What are you going to do? As much as I want to let her go down the path of sin... We were indeed married under a covenant of God.
And the Bible states that a man will not give up on his wife. So I use the power of prayer. I use... I use what I read in the Bible. And I use the Holy Spirit. Satan is real, working in spirit. He will tempt you and lead you and my wife astray. 